We woke up to a beautiful morning. It's been snowing a lot here lately. The pipes are frozen. It's negative 11 degrees Celsius here. And we currently don't have running water. Nothing. Nothing. So what that means is we're, we, I, am gonna have to go out and actually just get a little bit of snow because the most important thing that I need to do right now is give the hens some water. I also really need to be glorious day. Let's see. Yeah, I've got a selfie stick. Oh, check this out. Oh, can you see it? I can't tell. All that's left is for me to answer the call of nature. Peeing right now. Peeing. Miley. Excuse me. So if you're a smarty pants, that's like, Lauren, why don't you just start some fires and like heat the snow over the fires? Good idea. We've thought of that, obviously. We're not actually starting fires today because we have to prep for leaving for Stockholm. We have to go to Stockholm for a couple of days for Lisa's work. We have decided to head over to Lisa's mom's house this afternoon to stay overnight there, which is like 20 minutes away. Right now, we're just doing all the stuff that we need to do to get the house prepped and ready for that trip. As nice as a fire would be, it seems just like one too many things to, to try to deal with at the moment. I'm headed up to the hens. I've got a heat lamp, but I'm on my way up there to try to install that now because now we need to be able to keep the hens water unfrozen because we can't just replace it or replenish it as we wish. How can you really be mad when this is what's going on around you? Feels nice and tight in there. I'm not worried about the lamp coming down. I'll put the heating bulb in there. Then I'll put the grill on it. And then I'll actually do a test and see what happens if, uh, if it just warms for like 15 minutes. We've got power. Now let's uh, go connect that last plug in the chicken coop. lay not in their nests that I made them so I'm figuring that I need to make them bigger nests so I just put this box in here as a test to see if they like it or not 
So far, nobody's gone in there. All right, you guys. I'll be back in a few minutes. Let's see if your water is nice and unfrozen. That was a lot. Um, a lot that we didn't show because it was a bit stressful. I mean, just packing everything up with uh, Miley's house and uh, all the stuff for Poikis, for Nilo, and Nilo was really fuzzy. And at the same time, as he was really fuzzy, like he wasn't happy in any way, then Miley also got sick and started vomiting. And I didn't have any water left because I'd used all the snow water for doing dishes. So it was like crazy. It was just a ton of stuff all happening at the same time. Finally, we're in the car. I know what I'll be putting on the re big renovation list ASAP. What's that? Insulating pipes. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, so, it's not like when you buy a new house and you can like look through the specs and like, oh, this was installed in right. 20... 16 and this was you know it's like the last time someone lived here all year round was in the 70s once everything is set up at the farm it's gonna be like the dreamiest place that's where we bought it we have this we keep this vision in our minds and move uh, forward we got to our family's house and they called and said come down to the water so now I'm standing on the water with this shipwreck behind me Miley is make they gave me this to chill me out a bit and check out what's going on over here My brother-in-law Kalle Lisa's older brother Ice fish man Miley Psychopath It's cool to walk around like in a place where you never get to walk around. Yeah, it's really cool. It's a cool feeling Oh yeah, I have to go in there. It's a little too precarious. So cool though. Yeah, there's a lot of cool like um, pieces of wood and uh, iron and old stuff that you can actually salvage and use for Details. Details. Look at all this cool stuff. These big spikes and this old rudder. And that's Friedrich. He's our resident pro fisher. Fisherman. I feel good actually. Let's rephrase. I feel I feel good. It, good. Uh, it was a slightly stressful morning. Oh, because of what? Yeah, I I thought it was something else. <laughs> and this is the crying baby. He probably wants to look at stuff. Hey, hey, you're okay. to choose from you can take whichever you want anyone you like any bee that suits you there's this one or this one or these ones or over there there's a bunch on the table Day. We are inside, we are warm. The sauna is firing up. Oh, that'll warm these tootsies. Yeah. 
Oh, you're so warm. I'm so warm. I'm so red. I look like a pig, actually. <laughs> you don't look like a pig. You just look flushed. I am so hot. But Anyways, I've been, I've been rolling in the snow. And I'm about to go out there and do the same. Anything you want to say specifically? Uh, remember to keep your pipes insulated and unfrozen. <laughs> if you like videos like this and want to be a part of making them possible, head over to our Patreon page and check that out. Definitely. All right, we love you guys. We will see you next time. Bye.